Hi, now I'm going to work history here. Since I'm filming off of a phone that currently needs to charge, I now have this annoying charging cable that you are not able to see running from my phone and onto my lap onto an extension cord. It's annoying. Do you care? Probably not. I'm saying it anyway. Now, in terms of storage, it kind of sucks right now. Anyways. World War One restored er, uh, German gas mask canister. I couldn't think there. N around 1918. All right. See, that's tall. This is slightly shorter. By about there is like an accurate measurement. Now, yeah. Right. So this one is the original one that came in the M15. This is from 1916. Other one's 1918. That's the big difference there. Besides this. This retaining system is different on this one. Because this one has a little compartment for it that's a lot easier than this. And also, there's no latch for the, and yes, this is rusting. Also, yes, that is field modified. I thought that was cool. We don't have much time, folks. Maybe a more extensive video later, but this is a comparison. Anyways, yes, this one does have a system for that. And these are just reproduction straps. There's nothing special about them. And then over to here, I'll show you. So then see, and then you just lift that up and you take those out. And that's pretty simple. Um, not much to really say about that. All right, masks themselves. Both versions have this. Now this probably varied. This was to go around your neck as to hold. Now, as you probably know, most of these reproduction M15 gas masks are really just Austrian M15 gas mask reproductions. And so they do not like like look like the actual German one. Here's the inside of that. Would be a shame if that fell. That's what that looks like. Here's what this looks like. Whoops. There. Now it's more comfortable. Hopefully you can still hear me. I have no clue. Although this is easier to communicate than the leather ones, I will be doing a video on that when I get an original and a reproduction leather gas mask. I know, surprising, I have the M15 before I have the M17. Oh, wow. But here's this. Will I be putting my original on? No. Now, anyways, you've seen that one. Here's the original. There you are. Gotta be careful with this one. So as you see here, yes, it is taped because the gas can is, or not the gas can, yeah, the gas can, no. The uh, filter is falling apart and it is leaking everything that is ever to be inside that filter out everywhere and it's annoying. Anyways, as you can see, the filters are actually a little bit thicker than what you have on the, you know, um, Gabu, I forgot. <laughs> on the reproduction, see, my mind is not here today, it's not doing well, it's fine. Anyways, this is a lot stiffer. Of course, it's over 100 years old. Where does the major differences come in? These straps. See here? We have an elastic bit. Not on the reproductions. Let's show you the inside, although I'm trying not to... Here. See? It's different. Whoa, I know that's surprising. Oh, also there's like rubber around these, uh, on the eyes on the inside. Just thought to mention, and a lot more stamps. Of course, it'd be a lot more stamps. When I don't have this filter on it, because I will be getting a original replacement filter, just to replace that one that's falling apart and spreading all of its insides everywhere. When I do proceed to get a replacement filter, I'll do another video on this more in depth with a lot more detail shown to it. Also, the number stamping for your size there, which this is a two, is down there instead of up here, like on the reproduction. Now. How cool is this? I don't know. You tell me. This one doesn't fit me because I'm a size 3. Now, that being said, here. That's what it would look like on me. Not, it's a lot tighter. Like, I'd be able to speak, but, or not speak, but see, but speaking might throw the gas mask off my face. That being said, this also may have shrunk over time. I know the leather, leather ones usually do. The gummy gas mask ones, like these ones, not sure. Also, it is rubberized on the inside of this. I just saw I should mention for all of you people who didn't know. Now, 
tarring. Let's talk about that. Tarring for the stitching was important. Why? Because stitching may let the gas get in. This tar did not allow that. Very good thing. Filters were removable. We are running out of time. Oh, also, here's a strap. This one's made out of a gray canvas cloth. The original is cool and obviously better than the reproduction, but the reproduction is a lot more affordable than the expensive one that is original. Also, you can actually use this one for whatever you'd like to. But that being said, which one's better, the original? Which one's better for just using the reproduction one? Because you don't got to worry about this thing. See, I can do this. You can't do that with the original one. Why? It's original. Why would you do that with an original? That being said, when I have more time to do like a more in-depth video, I will. It's just a ba basic overview and I will be comparing, or comparing original gas masks soon. That being said, with my no script video that I have now completed, have a good day.